After a successful shoot, we headed back to Malaga and uh, straight back to Tarifa. Uh, and there I met up with Johnny again. Johnny, right there. There he is, we found him. We gaan morgen over de pier springen. What are we going to do? We gaan morgen over the pier springen. We gaan morgen over the pier springen. And we are considering jumping the pier. to destroy our party. Well, we'll put him on the roof of the camp. We found him in the old town and uh, really had a nice few drinks. And then he invited me to come DJ with him at Café Del Mar. What's up, guys? So tonight is quite an epic night. And we are meeting up with Johnny Arachno to play in Café Del Mar in Tarifa. So I got my inboard. So let's do this. I love Tarifa. Yeah, after uh, a good night DJing uh, at Café de Mar with Johnny. Yeah, in the morning uh, we actually were pretty hungover, so we slept in. And then uh, at the end of the day we were like, okay, let's do this. <laughs> to jump the pier because I told my friend Johnny that I'll jump easily over the pier and the camper. So it's our last day in Tarifa and uh, yeah, one shot, one opportunity, let's do this. I was definitely a bit nervous this time around because there were way more people involved and on the spot and there were other kites there. And uh, Nikki was stressing me out a little bit because she said, no, don't do it. Because somebody told her that the wind was very gusty and uh, I was like, yeah, of course the wind is gusty. And trust me, I can do this. <laughs> fear in my mind is that uh, you can die, you know, like uh, it can be a, a season ender or a life ender, you know. If, uh, if I wipe out and crash into the pier, I can hit my head, I can break a leg and, you know, everything can happen. jump just happened huh? I, had, I just had to do it I had this feeling that I could do it and uh, yeah we just nailed it spot on and I was super stoked landing this crash landing it I saw this wave coming and just butt checked out of it but the feeling was nonetheless very epic and uh, yeah, I'm just super stoked to be alive <laughs> in Conil de la Frontera. It's a pretty cool town actually. We tried to kite here but the wind wasn't good. So uh, this morning we're actually gonna meet a friend of mine, Maria, and uh, Johnny will be there and Heather and we're gonna do the bungee workout. It's a new type of workout and I think it's very suiting for on the fly because we're gonna fly. Wow this looks rather interesting. What a playground. This is called a the gym. There's just some bungees hanging around. I'm curious for the instructions. <laughs> Before I start monkeying around. So we just did a nice warming up and uh, now they're gonna tie me up to the rope. So I'm into the bungee. <laughs> No, 
No, the bungee workout is uh, totally about a fun workout. You know, you can do cardio or strength because you have to strengthen all your core to, to be able to fly. So, yeah, you basically it's a full body workout. So yeah, uh, the road trip ended perfectly. I couldn't wish for a better ending than the pier jump. And uh, now it's time to cruise back to the Netherlands. We got uh, two days there. <coughs> Clean up the RV a little bit and bring it back to Rebel Lease. <coughs> and then uh, the next adventures are waiting. What's up? On the fly it is. I'm on my way to Sri Lanka. Welcome to the Red Bull Man event. The extreme kiteboarding event that we've all been waiting for. <laughs>